Hi, this is Big Boat Ben on San Diego Bay, and today I'll be walking you through one of my new listings. It's a Tiara 2000 model year, 2900 Cornette Harbor Edition. It has a blue hull and blue canvas, white seats with blue piping, and it's in incredibly good condition. I don't know if you can see the shine there, if that shows up in the video, but this is a very shiny boat, and it's been kept in great condition since day one. Um, you can tell because there's no milkiness in the hall. The hall is absolutely great. As we come aboard, we have a nice swim platform here with a um, stowable ladder. And this swim platform is probably about two and a half feet long, so there's plenty of room to hang out and go for a swim. Very cool transom door as you come through. Great hinging, typical of Tiara. You've got a little breakage in it right here. And there's another little nick on one of the bolsters over in this area. Other than that, they're all fine. In your cockpit area, you have two seats that could fit three people each, and both of those are removable, very easily removable for fishing. Over in this area, we have our raw water and fresh water washdowns, our engine hatch lift, a 110 outlet. We have two rod holders here. We have storage here in each of these areas and storage here as well. We have an aft facing bench seat that can fit two to three people and forward of that you have your wet bar. Wet bar is there. Large ice chest here. You have another ice chest in this area and all of this is cutting board material so when it's time to fish you can use this for that. Here's your helm seat, and you have the companion to that over here. This is a very nice layout. I like it because it's part of the aft area, but you can also be part of uh, hanging out with the captain of the boat. I really love Tiara's flooring that they're known for. It feels really good underfoot and very safe. Um, this boat has a 10 inch subwoofer and Clarion stereo system with speakers all around. And it has a remote control here next to the cup holders. At the helm, we have a Furuno GP1850DF, that's a color GPS and fish finder. We have 340 hours on the boat. It's a direct drive boat, so you have throttles separately from your um, shifters and a very nice TR wheel. And I can tell you when I drove this boat over here, this thing has an amazing ride and very, very nice steering for a direct drive boat. Um, it just has a great feel to it when you're going through the water. It's definitely a connoisseur's boat. Here we have a map case. Two more cup holders, or three total cup holders. And up here, this window, if you were to push it up, it will open up and it has new gas shocks here. And also we have new canvas on this boat. And it also has a cover that goes all the way down the back and then one that covers the transom to keep the name nice. Uh, one thing I'd like to point out on this boat is here where the dash has spent some time in the sun it has cracks in the gel coat um, on both sides. I'm thinking that I'll probably put down some black vinyl um, like you'd use to put the signs on the back of the boat to just cover that area, cut down on glare and take care of that problem at the same time. As you go down into the boat you have nice wide stairs. Your battery switches are underneath these stairs here. You have a uh, teak and holly flooring and nice stainless steel sink, no water spots in it, doesn't look like it was ever used. Sansum microwave, you've got your stereo there, some storage, Norcold refrigerator, more storage down below, and here's your head on this side. Forward, we have a berth for two. There's a, a convertible piece that goes in here to make it a full berth. It's a very large berth. I would say it'd be good for people up to about six foot five, and you have storage on either side of it. You have a reading lamp here, and one over here. And if you look around, all this upholstery is in really good condition. Opening porthole here, and um, you also, on the bow, you have a remote spotlight and you also have a windless anchor that's controlled from the helm or from foot pedals up front. 
more storage in this area here. So overall condition of this boat, the fiberglass and gel coat are absolutely beautiful. Um, the only thing I could say on this boat would be the dash and then some weathering here. And uh, you know, if you look real closely here, I don't know if you can see that, but this is really shiny and supple, but there's some, I don't know if it's just old dirt that's been ground into the grain. Uh, it can probably be cleaned out. It appears on most of the seats, but they're still really nice and soft and in good condition. I don't know if I would change them, but if I was gonna pick one thing to say about this boat, that would be it. Let's go ahead and take a look at the engine room. Okay, so here they are, 7.4 liters, 320 horsepower each, and for a boat of this age, I would call these immaculate. The bilge is very clean, same here, it's very clean. And no expense is spared on the maintenance of this boat, in fact right now, um, this engine here was the water pump was just starting to fling a little water around and so I mean we're talking drops and so we've ordered the pump and we're replacing that right now um, but if you look at I mean it's just absolutely stellar for this age all your insulation is in good condition now that it's falling down This boat is listed at 56900 What I can tell you is that the owner of it is a two-boat owner. He just bought a much larger boat, and he figured he would keep this just to run around the bay, but he's since decided that he's having so much fun on his new boat that this one needs to be moved along. Um, he's uh, very open to hear whatever offers you can bring to him, so I would tell you not to hesitate. Uh, we are not looking for any trades on this boat. Um, but we are willing to sell it at a very reasonable price and uh, move it on down the road. So if you're interested in a viewing or needing more information, please call me at 619-800-3491 or you can uh, email me at bigboatben at gmail.com. Thank you very much and we'll see you out on the water.